Okay, why is this? Oh, wait, because this is a accepted culture group. Okay, that's fine. And uh, what is that thing about autonomy? Do I have to... Uh... Okay, this is uh, going into that, so we don't have to worry about that currently. Uh, truth is that three more years. God damn it, man. This is too long. I don't have time for this shit, man. I can't break a truce, though, is it? Unless uh, we attack their ally here. Eh, crap. Meva, so here, this region, more truce, bitch. And guarantee, shit. God damn it, I don't have time for this shit. I guess uh, try to, we will try to manually make some claims, and uh, I can I can keep going. You know that's the thing. I can easily keep going. And I don't want to sit here. It's a waste of time sitting here. Okay, why well, corruption is back down? Admin points is uh. Grand Captain dies. I don't care. I guess this is the time to let AE take down for a year or two. I guess. This vessels, two continents. Oh, God damn it. Just take it, I guess that's already ten percent off. Take that, and we it will get cheaper, anyways. Uh, do I have to break truce left and right, honestly? Fifty-four percent. This is not good, bruh. Mm. I miss the days when you form Moogles and you immediately get... Get, like, uh... Permanent claims over all of India, chat. Those were the good days. Okay, that's uh... I think we need, like I said, we need to do something about here. All provinces in La Hua area. All provinces... Okay, three of these. And let me guess, I already raised it uh, before. You know, fuck it, we'll just fight the rebels. Eighteen points, I just lost. Yeah, we'll just fight the rebels.
exploiting base tax is always a good way to get some extra cash flow. Okay, another 5%, the corporation cost reduction. I don't think we 5% really makes much of a difference. Because, like, in 100 development, you get... You get 5%, that's, uh... 100, that uh, costs about 250. 5% of that is, uh, like 70 points. I think uh, I'll just take more money. And we get some extra crown there. One percent is really not much, though. But uh, whatever helps. Okay, we can do this. Mm. You there, forty percent. Think I will might I might just I don't know. I might just call them in. Yeah, I will call them in separately and then just eat them. And uh And uh, unfortunately, there's nothing we can do about this part. But uh, conquering, starting to conquer this part would be helpful. What the fuck? Oh, get this guy out of here. And governing cap. We're still good. This is, yeah, this would, we will do it like this. Attack this guy and take these two guys, this guy in. This guy in. This guy, I will take his fort. His mountain, annoying mountain fort. We'll do it like that. Okay, we're not taking Delhi in.
Fidelity will die. Let's get these mountain forts out of the questions as fast as we can. We got the mill. Let's spend it. I might just delete the merc stack uh, later on for and, and grab another bunch of artillery. This is not great. Tolerance of true faith. Legalism, tax, manpower, tax cost. Okay, that's the number one. Do you there? Break it with the Mamluks. Give me the forts. This is fucking nonsense, right? All right, farm some prestige. Doing that. Mm. 
full course. Mm, this is expensive. I'll just save my 30 points at the moment. I mean, I don't really care about making Delhi into a state in the first place. Okay, Rise of Manchuria. <laughs> Ming is uh, in trouble, it seems. Okay, good. Now we continue our conquest down. Okay, this will have to wait for sure, but uh, then we get uh, secure this port. I think uh, we do need that. Maybe I should just chill <laughs> and just speed five my way through. That would probably be a lot easier than trying to figure this shit out. This shit is a mess and it's not fun to deal with. Maybe I'll just grab the forts. And we'll use a vassal, Mauwa, for a little reconquest after this. Yeah, I think that that might be a good idea.
this is the uh, west edge of India, right? Mawa. Alright, Mao releasing Mawa will def I think releasing Mao is definitely the right choice. Um Not to mention the immediate reconquest that I can start using. And uh, let's get some cash. I mean, I probably don't need the cash, but... Uh, mm -hmm. Probably don't really need the cash. But I think it will help. We can always grind them something to, to core, right? Okay, do we reconquer con do a conquest first? Or I think we should do a conquest first. Because otherwise I cannot proceed to the for the Bengal mission. And uh, Vaginagar is allied with this guy. Four years. Okay, that 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 would actually. Yeah, it's all these Hindus over here. Okay, yeah, let's get Vaginaga into it. And uh, we can make some claims, clean up this region, and also use this for a truth reset. Three guys, we can eat and then we can choose reset, Gujarat. Let's give it Bengal in as well. Oh wait, Bengal might take my shit, so maybe not the best idea. Should have enough time.
maybe make a claim there as well, just in case. Twenty five fucking prestige. getting unrest peasant rage what is this what the fuck is peasant rage Five zero. Well, I can't say I dislike that because I will fill admin anyway. I can't say I dislike this because I will fill uh, admin group next. So, really, actually, not a bad idea. I mean, if we get the queen, that would be even better. 566 six, Queen. Actually, let's try to kill Babur. Maybe that would uh, work. If we kill Babur, the Queen takes over, and then we can all just like keep uh, extending the Regency. <laughs> like a total bitch. Just let the Queen usurp the throne. That would work. Moving to legalism means I can't con I don't have the conversion strength. That's kind of stuck. Let's uh, get rid of some cavalry as well. I don't really think we need so many. I'd rather take another 10k artillery. Make it into a proper stack. Uh, might be time to break the alliance with 
bank. Oh wait, we should break it after we take the land. What the fuck is this? Ah, uh, well. If Pamani's wants this shit, we'll give him this shit. And we will not join your bullshit offensive war. No thanks. Okay, truth reset. First one. What? Wait, I just... How did I just get a permanent claim? I just made a claim normally, I got a permanent one. The fuck? It must be hard-coded then. But it shouldn't be, right? Because I'm getting this here. This makes no sense. What did I just recover be this claim because I was timorous? Damn, the coding in this game, chat. Artillery, where are you? Are you allied with anyone now? I don't think they are. Yeah, I don't think they are. Let's cut them off anyways. This will be fine. God, this is definitely a normal claim. Okay, what else? We clean up these two guys. Uh, we do this guy next. The fuck again? This... The guarantees! Well, should have taken money from them last time. What an asshole. What a stupid asshole.
28 months. No, well, still could be worse. Okay, this is fine. So far, so good. Yeah, I should have taken the money, but uh, now it's too late. I want to keep this short and sweet. Cancel your shit with Bengal and uh, take some cash because we won't be able to attack them so quickly, anyways. Uh, eight year truce, that's okay. And we delete the forts. We get back to improving relations with some outraged countries. Oh, man, looks uh, fighting the Ottomans now. Huh. A strong man look might not be a bad idea. I'm losing manpower like crazy. Why? Why don't we get losing 1% each? Well, shit, I need more manpower, I think. And let's see, my AE is dropping by 3.3 .3 a year. That is okay. Quite okay. So let's see here. We need as many provinces as we can. Development does not matter. Upper. Lower. Upper, lower. Keteha. Where is Keteha? Oh, this one. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five. Okay. So, let's see. I suppose avoiding his capital is the way to do it. 
How many do we need anyway? Well. Shit, that's gonna be tricky. Fourteen. Twenty-four. Jesus. Eleven. Okay, this a ten. The yellow ones are okay. Look now. Yeah, these are okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh shit. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. We need one more. And this will do. Oh shit, just enough. Yeah, this is not, not fun. Definitely not funny. Let's get going again. Okay, have we finished coring the last parts? Now we have to bite the bullet now anyway. Burn down the development. Should lower the AE quite a bit. And we got this. Production efficiency. It would take one year to call all this crap because they are literally my primary culture group. And then we can do this here. <laughs> We're going so fast, it's not even funny. Unconditional surrender, another one. 
since when Indians became French. Okay, let's speed five through this then. I need my, a little bit of time for my manpower to recover anyway. There's still, yeah, these are still kind of fucked up. You're almost done. Fifty admin power. This guy's fifty years old, so maybe I should get the. Advisor, because I am, like I said, I'm hard pushing admin, and uh, colonialism comes in a bit. And we also want that. Every own province of Hindu religion will lose 10 years of separatism. Sure. Why not? Well, now we do get uh, another advi cheap advisor. This game looks great so far. Yes, Hensley, what's up? It, 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 it's going a lot faster than expected. Because last time I played the Mooko was trying to do this. It was uh, it was the true Air Timur, I believe. And of course, the start is quite different. But uh, now we're playing the Timur. It starts, obviously. Uh, our power base is in uh, much better shape. So everything goes a lot smaller. Faster and smoother. I mean, it's kind of the gimmick of playing a big nation in EU4. You start big and then nothing can stop you. You snowball basically unlimited. Okay, I want to... I might want to integrate this guy. Perhaps is a good idea. Perhaps. I mean, I can keep them, but they do take up a slot. Um, yeah, keeping them might be... Yeah, I will integrate them. I mean, I can... I already, um... Force them to give me their trade, but... So, so trade-wise, it doesn't actually matter. But uh, they do take up a slot, which I could have used for getting another ally somehow. At least I think that uh, might be a good idea to move it. And guess what, chat? My capital is even stronger than Constantinople. <laughs> God damn. With the great mosque and the training field, this is insane. Let's put some stuff down for the silk provinces. And like I said, any manpower. 250 is a bit low. Actually, I should uh, use some of my points, mill points, to develop for manpower. I just need some good provinces. 
Yeah, and maybe Persia in a bit. Central Persia somehow. And I, like I was saying, like many... A lot earlier, I should... Uh, put some ports down. Just in case the AI get any ideas trying to go through uh, Uzbekistan. I'll change the goal. Okay, that's the goal that we just changed. Idea cost! Thank you! Woohoo! Damn, son! 250 points for an idea. Oh, what the fuck? What the fuck? Fuck. Ah, crap. Oh, whatever. Oh, yeah, wait, I should wait until uh, a bit, wait a little bit before developing because, um, well, five years. I think my mill will, uh, will, will overflow before that, unfortunately. I don't know. Uh,. Yeah, about that. My mill will overflow. But there is nothing nice here, is it? Well, this is decent. Cotton, dry land. But, uh, yeah, it also has prosperity. It's next to my capital. My capital state is trash, that's the issue. Either here in Afghanistan, or we do it here in Persia. Afghanistan is probably better though, because it's right next to the capital. But we shall see in a bit. I would prefer Persia though. It, it's, I remembered institutions spread faster if uh, if it's coastal, I think. At least for colonialism, it does. And, uh, and it's... And I mean, the silk is fucking silk, Chad. It's, it's, it's more money. And I get I get to collect it back in Persia, but it, this is still not bad. Cotton still go up to what three point six or something, or four I think. I don't actually remember. Actually, wait, cotton also reduced by ten percent, right? Yes, it does actually. Prosperity. The main thing, though, is that it will spread to head up, so I don't have to worry about getting the 10%. Normally, I would definitely do it here, in Persia, with the Silk Province, the... the... the buffs from being a trade center. It, it, it doesn't really matter. We have a Abundant of we have an abundant of points. It doesn't actually matter that much. Okay, now Bengal. My next missions dictate that we go and conquer more things. 
especially Bengal. I need to truce reset this guy first. I think we can do it with uh, good threat. Otherwise, they're guaranteeing somebody, right? Yeah, they're guaranteeing somebody, right? So we f we 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 core it, and then we choose reset this guy, and uh, yeah. I think this is the main thing, though. We need to get Mawa to push south to Dash. And, well, Bamani's in general. Well, actually this part. But Dash also. And this side deals with Bengal, which we also should work towards. Uh, Burma can wait, I'd say. Got like, what, 55 years? Maybe I won't hit the time. Maybe I won't hit the time to get out of India before 1550. At least not without some truth breaking, but we we will see. You speak Cantonese? Yes, I do. Uh, well, Mandarin was never my mother tongue, if you don't know. Now I actually feel like uh, getting, what was it, uh, admin ideas let me choose brick with cheaper step, right? So you speak both? Yeah. Well, I make some mistakes uh, here and there in Mandarin, but uh, it's basically the same language with different pronunciations. Well, I mean, the mainland China has their own like slangs and shit these days, you know? Is like different flavor of English, you know what I mean? So different, you can't understand each other anymore. Well, it's not exactly, um, it's not like so it's not like so different dude it's like uh you know like it's a spectrum right like mandarin is basically the northern part northern dialect and cantonese is like the southern dialect right so if you compare cantonese with something else in the south it actually doesn't sound so dissimilar you know what i'm saying so it, 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 it the fun part is actually when whenever I go to a Vietnamese restaurant and they start talking to each in, in Vietnamese to each other, 